The states found an easy way to raise revenue. They got lotteries out there. Oh, they got gaming God. out right. there. They got all kinds of stuff out there. But you know what? The states are addicted to the revenue of the gambling money. Mm -hmm. And some of that money comes from compulsive gamblers who end up destroying their lives. I know at least a dozen people personally that have committed suicide because they have this addiction and couldn't cope with it and couldn't stop gambling and have killed themselves. The difference between traditional gamblers and slot players are the slot players can't stop. I, I, I saw very rarely do I have a slot player that ca calls me on my hotline, 888 bet and says, I need help, and they go in and they stop. They relapse and relapse and relapse. I hear stories from slot players that say, it's like a string pulling me in. It's like a magnet pulling me in. I've heard some slot players, female slot players, tell me and my wife when we do trainings, they tell us that they have almost sexual experiences with these slot machines. <laughs> so I've seen you, these Mark. slot players, six months and two years, they burn themselves out, they go through everything. And where you didn't see that years ago with sports gamblers like I was, or, or racetrack gamblers, or, or uh, people that gamble traditional gambling, the slot gamblers burn themselves out very quickly and very fast. And the machines are very fast, so Correct. it kind of makes sense. Faster, quicker action, the faster addiction occurs.